You're watching the Super Andrew Network. Last time on SACE. The contestants that failed to conquer their biggest fears finds treasure at the beach with metal detectors as the elimination challenge. Tails found the treasure first and Mario got eliminated. At Cake at Stake, Patrick joined the show with 361 votes to join. The contestants have to avoid colors as the 24th challenge. They went to the mall, the water park, and ate onion rings. In the end, Pac-Man won against Goku, and Red, Jotaro, Owen, and Saro have fallen to the danger zone. Who will be eliminated next? How delicious will the next challenge get? Well, you're about to find out as we're going to Italy on this episode of Super Andrew 4 and 8 Character Elimination. What's going on over there? I have no idea. Me neither. Ever since Patrick joined, everyone started lining up to sign up for the last debuting ceremony. Oh yeah, there's one more spot for the recommended character to join. Come on, come on down! Sign up for the final debuting ceremony in SACE! Over hundreds have signed their names in, but only 30 will be nominated to join. And most importantly, only one will actually join the show! Wahaha! I've already signed up! Same here! I can't wait to see if I got accepted to be nominated! Isn't it crazy that the final debuting ceremony is about to happen soon? I know, can't believe it's happening. But only one will join the show as the 33rd contestant. I have a 30% chance that the debuting ceremony will happen on episode 29. Alright, can you tell us your name and what series are you from, please? I'm DJ from Total Drama. <laughs> Whoa, how did that happen? With my latest invention, the Mind Rider 7000. Wow! Oh man, did you guys see the line? Yep, it's really, really long! Come on guys, let's go to Cake at Stake and see who's going to be eliminated next. Good idea, Link! Cake at Stake! Welcome to Cake at Stake. You guys failed to avoid the colors and fell into the danger zone, so you'll be doing Cake at Stake. We got 432 prize votes and 427 elimination votes. A total of 859 votes. As usual, we'll start with the prize votes. Saro, you got 27 votes to win the prize. Aw, oh, come on, man! Owen has received 68 votes. Ah, give me a break, dude! Now for the triple digits. Red, you got 118 votes. Not enough. Ah, oh, well. And with 219 votes, the prize goes to Jotaro! Yes! Jotaro, your prize is a lightsaber, which comes in many colors. Blue, green, purple, and even red. Awesome! Now for the elimination votes. I have three plates of fish sticks. If you don't get one, then it's game over for you. Let us begin. Owen, you're the first one safe, with 41 votes. Yeah! Red, even though you were stupid enough to step inside the confessional booth during the challenge last episode, because it's blue, the color you have to avoid, but failed, I know, I know. That doesn't change the fact that you're safe with 53 votes. Phew! Looks like another anime character is going home. Who will it be? Jotaro Kujo or Hanta Sero? Well, it's quite shocking that Jotaro is safe with 65 votes. Yes! Ah, crap! Then that means... With a shocking total of 268 votes, Saro is eliminated. <gasps> oh man, I can't wait for Hibiki and Fugo, and I hate to see the looks on Class 1A's faces. No, no, it can't be. Oh heck no. That soy sauce face is gonna get it when I slap his face! Bro, calm down, dude. Yeah, 12th place out of 32 isn't that bad. I don't care! I'm gonna start a riot! <sighs> like that's ever gonna happen- Oh no, he's serious! Stop him! Do oh, it, Shadow! Calm down, Why it's just a show! Me. But on the bright side, at least I had fun! And I get to see them again! Hey, win for me, Jotaro and Goku! Alright, we will, man! Ready! Aim! Fire! <laughs> Here I come! I am Hantasero! Well, to be honest, that's what he gets for being the first one out last challenge, failing to conquer his fear, and spelling a word incorrectly. Mm-hmm. Okay, guys, enjoy your fish sticks, and get some rest, because tomorrow, we'll be doing our 25th challenge.
Yo, I'm here. No way. My goodness, it's so great to see you again, Zero. Yeah, I miss you guys so much. Yo, they're all reunited. Isn't that awesome? Yep. Hey, you guys want to hear about all the challenges I've been through while you guys were eliminated? Yeah, we do. With Zero gone, Goku and I are the only anime characters still standing. That's right, Jojo! Can't believe we made it this far! We made it to the final 11, guys! That's right, Owen! And next episode, we'll finally arrive at the home stretch! Home stretch? Yeah, the home stretch happens when there are only 10 contestants left, which will happen next episode. Cool! Hey, guys! Ready for the 25th challenge? Yeah, we are! What will it be? I can't wait! You'll find out, Red! Yo, why are we in Italy? Good question, DK! The 25th challenge is Pasta Cooking Contest! Yum! Pasta! Mmm, hold up. So, does like the cooking challenges happen on the episodes that has the number 5 in it? I guess so, Link. Hey, Andrew, will there be another cooking challenge in episode 35? No, there will not be one on that episode, since there will only be 3 contestants remaining, according to my calculations. Oh, understandable. Boy, oh boy! Are you excited for our first cooking challenge, Tails? Yeah, I am! You can use any noodles and ingredients you want, but don't screw up too much. The contestant with the best pasta dish will be the winner! Alright, I got the water in the pot! Me too! Now we have to set it here for it to boil. So, um, how long will it take for the water to start boiling? Approximately around 3 minutes and 30 seconds for the water to boil at 100 degrees Celsius! which is 212 degrees Fahrenheit. Ah, I see. So what noodles are you guys gonna get? The macaroni elbow noodles, so I can make mac and cheese. Oh, same here, but I'm gonna add some chili and bacon on mine. Okay, there's the spaghetti noodles. Hmm, where's the trinette noodles? Aha, I found it! Spaghetti noodles, check. Chili peppers, check. Hot sauce, check. Jalapenos, check. Meatballs, check. Where did you get the ingredients from? From the ingredient shop? Ha, ah, yeah! Gotta get some ingredients, too! I'll need olives, cheese cubes, red peppers, banana peppers, cucumbers, parmesan cheese, and Italian salad dressing. Hmm, making pasta salad, I see. Coming right up. I'll go get the ingredients for you, Red! Well, at least you got the tricolor rotini. Yep, I got that checked out. That'll be 41 cents. Alright, the water's boiling! Time to put the pasta in! Don't forget to stir the noodles in the pot so it doesn't stick. I recommend adding olive oil to make the noodles not stick together, and salt to make the water boil faster. Ooh, good idea! Hmm, how long is it going to take for everyone to get their pasta noodles done? Can't tell, Sonic! You're going to have the pasta al dente or regular? I'd say al dente. Why not cut to commercial while we cook the pasta? Good idea, DK! Yo, guys, you can cut to commercial now. You got it, dude! Stick around, viewers! SACE will be back right after these messages. Ever since Arby's partnered with E-League, all our food keeps blowing up. So why should we waste our time describing those cute little seasoned curls? Their twisty, crispy outsides. Their twisty, soft insides. Insides. Arby's, we have the meat. The Dairy Queen Sweet Deals value menu has nine items to choose from. Any two for three dollars, any three for four, and any four for five. So I can choose from over 20,000 meal combinations! I'm gonna need a bigger tray. DQ Sweet Deals, what's your deal? Well guys, we don't have anything for breakfast. Ah! Then that means no pancakes! If only there's a place where we can have pancakes. Peter Griffin?! Yup, that's me, and I'm here to take you guys somewhere! Where are we? We are at the Pancake House, where we make the finest pancakes of all time. That's right. We also make waffles and French toast too. Cool. I'll have chocolate chip pancakes with lots of maple syrup. Splendid choice. I'll have the same thing. Me too. Coming right up. So yeah, if you're looking for the tastiest pancakes of all time, then come on down to the Pancake House. 
Hey guys, Shrek here, and we're back once again to celebrate the anniversaries of video games, movies, TV shows, anime, and more. Here's what we're celebrating this year. So yeah, happy anniversaries to the movies, TV shows, video games, anime, and more that is shown on this screen. We'll see you guys next time for more. Traveling with any baggage? Yeah, here he comes now. Oh, ah! oh man. Ah! Hey, what are you looking at? He's looking at my peanut. <laughs> I feel so violated. What is so suspicious about candy-coated chocolates who walk and talk? I guess you gotta check out everybody, though. Wow. Great casting job. Excuse me, gorgeous. Is this a snack flight? <laughs> it is now. Ah! Hey guys, visit the Waddle Dee Cafe. We have Carmouth Cakes, Kirby Burgers, Energy Drinks, and Maxim Tomatoes. If you want to work here, be our guests. But watch out for Lunch Rush. Why aren't you facing the camera, man? It's my duty to look for people who wants to be hired by us. Huh. Well, if you're hungry, then find us at Waddle Dee Town near Summer City Beach. And now, back to SACE. Alright everyone, it's now judging time, so who will be tasting our dishes? The recommended characters will be tasting your dishes. Take a look up there and see why. Oh my goodness. That is a lot of recommended characters! Not gonna lie, I lost count on how many there are. <laughs> Looks like the restaurant for the challenge are gonna need more tables. <laughs> so how many are there, Tails? Well, there's possibly 825 recommended characters that will be trying out our pasta dishes. HOLY! <laughs> Even more than 191 recommended characters trying out the burgers that Shrek, Yoshi, Mario, Pikachu, and I made on episode 22 last season. Hey guys, keep in mind that one recommended character will join the show in the future. <gasps> oh yeah, that's right. There were people signing up for the debuting ceremony earlier. We'll be going in alphabetical order. Donkey Kong, you're up first. Yes! Here it is, macaroni and cheese. Mmm, my favorite. Alright, send them the dishes. What? But we only made one dish, and there's 825 hungry customers. The pasta dish will be sent to a cloning machine, and will clone 825 of them. Oh, I see. Wowee! Mac and cheese! It smells really good! Let's dig in! The results are coming in. Let's see what they have to say. Yo! Out of 825 people, 798 loved your mac and cheese. Yeah, yeah! Goku, you're up next. Here's my tortellini dish! I used Alfredo sauce and garlic too! <laughs> Smells good, Goku! Could that be? Yep, that's tortellini, my friend! Huh, not bad! Up next is Link! This here is my fettuccine Alfredo! Wow! Splendid dish, Link! Yo, this dish smells good! I know, right? I can already taste it! Mmm, Stitch loves Fettuccine Alfredo. Ha! Suck it, Goku! My dish got a better score than yours! Ah, oh, shut up, Mr. Sword and Shield! Oh, roasted! Here, I made spaghetti and meatballs. Mmm, a classic. Aw, oh, yeah! Gonna need some Parmesan with this. Meatball, meatball, spaghetti underneath! Ravioli, ravioli, great berry reef! Awesome! I knew they love spaghetti and meatballs. Anyways, you're next, Owen. Uh, I don't know if this is considered a pasta dish or not, but I made a lasagna. Hmm, Garfield's favorite. Also, lasagna is a pasta dish. Whew, well that's a relief! Oh yes, this looks delicious and smells delicious. Every time I have lasagna, it reminds me of Summer Inch Cat from the comics. You mean Garfield? Yes, of course. 
Uh, did I mess up or something? Of course not! 721 people loved your dish out of 825, man! Goku's right. 721's a good score. Ah, I see. Yo, Pac-Man, you're up next! I made chicken Alfredo. Hmm, much like Link's fettuccine Alfredo, but you added chicken. But hey, it smells good. Yep, and I'm aware of that. Fettuccine Alfredo again? It's got chicken in it, Eve! That's why it's called Chicken Alfredo! Comparing to Link's Fettuccine Alfredo, this will taste different in a good way. You're not wrong, Sora. Hmm, that's pretty good. 710 isn't that bad. I'll allow it. Okay, we're done. Let's compare the scores. So, it looks like Sonic's Chili Bacon Mac and Cheese got the highest score of 807 out of 825, which means Sonic is the winner! Yes! Now then, for every person that dislikes your dish, you lose one point. These are your current scores from now on. Red, Patrick, Jotaro, and Owen. You have fallen into the danger zone, but since Patrick joined the show last episode, he gets immunity. Yay! That means the voting will only be between Red, Jotaro, and Owen. Ah, crap, not again! That means one of us is not gonna make it to the final 10, or known as the home stretch. Also, this will be the last time that the voters will be voting on who will win a prize, so one of you guys will win the final prize. Oh man, and after that, it'll be just the elimination votes. Yep, you're correct, Red! Well, now that the challenge is over, what do you guys wanna do? Oh, I know! Let's eat garlic bread! Why can't we just go for a boat ride? I would love to see the scenery of Italy! Guys, I have a better idea! Let's go for a boat ride and eat garlic bread! Tails, that is an awesome idea! Let's go enjoy all that Italy has to offer for us! Okay! So yeah, vote by using a letter in square brackets in the comment section or in the community page on who you want to be eliminated or to win the prize. You can choose Red, Jotaro, or Owen. Whoever gets the most votes will be the 24th contestant eliminated, and the other will win the final prize. Remember, voting ends on July 30th. Man, the air is so fresh today. I know, right? Wowee! Look at that, guys! Wow, it's so cool! Hey, there's the restaurant that we did the challenge in! Oh yeah, what's it called? House of Pasta? I guess so. Hey guys, so get this. Did you know that Eurobeat is made in Italy here? Whoa! I didn't even know that before! Me neither. Also, I have a feeling that we should reenact the torture dance scene. Ooh, that sounds great! Wanna join us, Link? Yeah, sure! Can we watch you guys, even though we won't be doing it? Please? Sure! Come on, guys! Watch us do the torture dance! Ah, sweet! I'll go start up the music! Let's do this! Stay tuned for scenes from our next episode! The Transformers War has invaded our world, and the Earth is no match for the evil Decepticons! Led by Megatron's hunger for power, they will destroy anything in their way. Disguised as Earth vehicles, Optimus Prime and the heroic Autobots have the power to protect the world from the destruction of the Decepticons. The battle's beginning. Which side are you on? Autobot or Decepticon? Transformers figures each sold separately. Actual change time will vary. Hey, hey, hey! Since I got eliminated with SpongeBob on episode 23, Bowser's Barbecue is now open at the Eliminated Contestors Resort! We make the best barbecue ever! Now you can try the new barbecue bacon brisket sandwich! Come on down to the Eliminated Contestors Resort and find us next to Pizza Hut! Ha ha ha! Next time on SACE! Oh crap! We're going to space! I've never been to outer space in my entire life! So what's with the spacesuits and the cool hats? The 26th challenge is a game of Among Us. Nine of you will be crewmates, while one of you will be the imposter. How hard it is to fix the wires! Pfft, piece of cake. 
Just match the colors of the wires and everything will be A-OK. -okay. Unless the imposter vents here. Oh, hey, how'd you vent? He's the imposter! Run! 